Hey guys, Assalamu alaikum, Namaste and Wanaka. Welcome back to my channel, Samira Shari. Hi guys, so today's video is all about this look. Firstly, thank you so much for all the love that you guys have been giving me on my makeup videos. Thank you so much guys. So I thought why not share with you guys the makeup look that I wear for my YouTube videos. So when I'm filming my YouTube videos, I either shoot one or two videos a day and uh, I don't need to have the makeup entire day. I don't want it to last for the entire day unlike for my TV shows or serials something like that. So most of the time while I'm filming my YouTube videos, I make use of only the drugstore products and not the high-end ones. That doesn't mean that drugstore isn't good and all of that. I love, love, love drugstore products as well. So now today's video is all about how I do my makeup for the YouTube videos. Now, without any further ado, let's get started. Alright guys, so first things first, moisturization is very important. So I'm already done with my skin prep. Now I'm going to use PAX Take Cover Concealer in the shade Toffee. And I'm going to apply it under my eyes, around my mouth near my nose and also any dark spots that I have around my face like so and once I'm done applying the concealer I let it sit for some time and meanwhile I'm gonna apply Maybelline's Fit Me in the shade 310 sun beige. I'm gonna take little of that onto my finger and dot it all over my face like so. Not to forget your neck guys. And once I'm done dotting the foundation all over my face and next I'm gonna take a beauty blender. So this is a damp beauty blender. I picked this one from Shein. If you haven't seen my Shein haul, I'll make sure I link it down in the description box and also in the eye bar right there. And now with the help of this beauty blender, I'm going to start blending my foundation like so. And once I'm done blending the foundation as well as the concealer in its place, and not to forget your ears and neck guys, make sure everything is evenly spread all throughout your face, ears and neck. <laughs> And once that's done, if I need to apply some more concealer around my mouth or under eye, that is what I'm going to do next. And with the help of my finger, I'm just going to dab it around my mouth and under my eye onto the places where I've applied the concealer. I'm just going to dab it with the help of my finger. And once that's done, I'm going to take Maybelline's Fit Me Loose Powder in the shade 25 medium mauve and with the help of the same beauty blender i'm going to take little and start applying under my eyes and with the same amount of powder which is on the beauty blender i'm going to apply it on my t-zone around my nose and under my chin and uh, if required i'm going to take some more and apply the same amount all over my face make sure you don't apply too much powder else it's going to get very very cakey <laughs> And once I'm done evenly applying the powder all over my face, I'm going to use Maybelline's Master Contour and with the help of my finger, I'm going to contour just my nose like so. And once that's done, I'm going to take the Body Shop's Honey Bronze and apply it on the apples of my cheeks to give it that pink tint. And then with the help of a spoolie, I'm going to brush my brows in place. And then with the help of the brown shade in Pack Eyebrow Definer, with the help of an angular brush and start applying it onto my brows. So now when I'm applying on my brows, the first thing I do is I start from the lower line of the inner corners and then I go onto the arch and start filling my arch and then drag it towards the upper side of my inner corner and I don't take any extra product from there and whatever is left on the brush I just run through on the upper side of the inner corner and then I'm going to repeat the same onto my left eyebrow. <music> and 
and once I'm done filling my brows again with the help of a spoolie I'm just gonna brush my brows in place and once that's done I'm gonna take K Beauty's plush it's eyeshadow pencil and it is something that is one of my favorite from the K Beauty so I'm gonna take use of this eyeshadow pencil and first start applying onto the lower lash line and then using the same pencil I'm gonna apply it onto my eyelids like so and once I'm done applying the eyeshadow onto my lower lash line as well as my eyelids with the help of my finger with a very light hand I'm just gonna rub it in place and then I'm gonna use this PAX baked highlighter in the shade 12 and with the help of a fan brush I'm gonna apply it onto the bridge of my nose and on my cheekbones and my chin and definitely onto my cupid's bow and once I'm done applying the highlighter, I'm gonna apply the lipstick and the lip shade that I've used is Lacmes Enrich Matte in the shade PM11 and this is a nice bright pink but I somehow don't like wearing this bright pink so what I do is I just apply very little onto my lips and then I'm gonna take K Beauty's VRs and this is one beautiful nude which is gonna subtle the pink and on top of the pink shade, I'm going to apply this nude shade. Once I'm done applying that, I'm going to take the big highlighter and apply it in the inner corners of my eyes to give it a nice open look. And last but not the least, I'm going to take the K-Beauty's mascara and start applying generous amount of mascara on my upper lash as well as my lower lash. So that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed watching and i hope this was informative do let me know how you guys enjoyed watching this makeup tutorial and also the other makeup tutorials do let me know if you guys are interested in watching a few more makeup tutorials for example a beat my haldi look beat my mehendi look or also my nikah or walima look because all those looks were created by myself so do let me know if you guys are interested in watching those i would love to recreate all those looks for you guys do let me know in the comment section down below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet don't forget to subscribe and also hit the bell icon right there so that you'll be notified every time i put up a new video and that's it guys i'll see you all soon in my next video until i'll see you next lots of love